Hi everybody, this is Odd Samurai and today I'm going to be reacting to One Piece episode 1088 which is going to be the last episode of the year uh, for One Piece because I don't think we're going to have a new episode until uh, the start of January which is going to be the start of uh, the Egghead arc so yeah also I'm just I'm glad that I that I waited to make the reaction for this episode because man there was some big news on that jump festa uh, on Saturday <clears throat> so yeah first I I'm mostly excited about the remake uh, we don't know exactly it's, it's just been announced that it's happening that's it we don't know anything else other than it's uh, being made by which studio and that's about it we just know it's happening, but we don't have a date. We don't know if it's gonna go beyond uh, the East Blue Saga, and if it will, if and if it does, then will it stay at Witch Studio? Uh, there, there's a lot of factors here that I'm a bit unsure about, but also it's just it does feel a little bit, you know, I. Mean, I'm someone who's grown to love so much this uh, adaptation by Toy and all the amazing people that have uh, participated in it, whether it's directors, the art, the, the, the art designers, the animators, and, and all that, you know. It does kind of feel a bit like, you know, like telling them all, you know, your work isn't good enough, too bad, we're, we're just going to uh, another thing. Well, this is still going. <clears throat> so that feels a bit mm, not insulting, but you know. Like, of course, we, we all know that uh, One Piece has had uh, issues with pacing, so that's the only reason I would, I, I've always been... I, I I wouldn't have minded a remake, but I, I just, I, I don't know how I feel about it while the anime is still ongoing, you know? So, and also there's the, the fact about the voice actors, like we don't even know if all of them, uh, well, about the Straw Hats at the very least, they'll all, uh, <sighs> It's, it's hard to say, but if they'll all uh, still be around uh, while, um, you know, if they'll all be around at the end of the One Piece anime, this one. So, yeah, I can't imagine them also having to go another round for a remake, so yeah, that's also another thing. I mean, I'll, I'll I'll be watching and see, you know, how it is that they do it. But it, it I, I don't know. Like I said, I'm mostly looking forward to it, but there's some stuff where I'm like, uh, I, I don't know about it, basically. Uh, in there, we also get uh, voice actors for all the satellites and Vegapunk. Which is cool. I don't think I know any of them other than Aya Hirano, who has done, you know, a lot of uh, anime voice acting over the years. But I know her mostly from uh, Gintama, as she does on uh, Nobume, Imai Nobume in there. And there's also, well, we had a message from Oda, and it was like, Oh, we're, we'll uh, we'll leave Egghead uh, next year and go to a certain island that has been, you know, that we've already been said that we're going there. And everyone's like, Elpaf? Which, I mean, yeah. Everyone is expecting Elpaf to be in the next, next island. So, but I'm not sure how I will, if I believe Oda that we'll uh, leave in Egghead th this year. Uh, maybe, I mean... <laughs> As long as he, you know, doesn't rush it. And then... 
Oh yeah, there, there, there's gonna be like a battle between a, a character and a character that we will be like, oh, is that character gonna win? It's super vague. So who knows if we'll be able to uh, see that, oh, when that happens, uh, if Oda was able to be like, oh, this is what he meant. Oh, uh, what else? Well, there, there was some celebration about the live action and there's already, there was already an announce announcement that we're getting season two. And we had uh, the actors for Luffy and Jacob over there with the rest of the voice actors. That was really cool. I know some people may not have liked it, but I, I thought it was really cool. And then we had uh, the Straw Hats voicing some scenes from Egghead that haven't been animated yet, which was super hype. Especially uh, Luffy being in Gear 5th again, I think, when he's fighting Luchi. So that's, yes, something I'm looking forward to it. Uh, with Wizard, I, I feel like I already covered everything about the Jump Festa, I think. Because we didn't get anything new from the Monsters anime. Which, hopefully I can react to it. I don't know if, it, if it'll be... I just know it's coming to Netflix. And that... Um, and the character designs. And that's how it, about it. I haven't read Monsters, so that would be completely new to me. But I don't know if it'll be like a movie or like a full-on anime season. I don't know. They could do it any format, really. Considering how uh, Pluto was released, you know? The one, uh, the, the anime by uh, the mangaka Urasawa, who also did ha has a manga called Monster, but that's neither here nor there. <laughs> I think I've been babbling too much. Let's just get on with the episode because there's a scene I've been really looking forward to ever since uh, we've gotten uh, to the last parts of Wano. So, yeah. Depending on how it's done, I might do. I, I might actually change my YouTube um, profile picture to uh, an image of Luffy from this. So, with that said, I'm at one minute and thirty nine seconds. I repeat, I'm at one minute and thirty nine seconds. <clears throat> so, with that, let's start in five, four, three, two, one, go. Oh, Hancock's Seraphim. What is this? Well, why are we using this music? Oh, it's just called Luffy's Dream, bro! Let's freaking go! The way Luffy looks here? Hype. One Piece episode titles are always so long and this is just two words. Oh, they're already showing the aftermath? Weird. A former captain of the Kuja Pirates. Yeah, I could have sworn in the manga they showed this after <clears throat> we see Rayleigh saving Hancock. Yeah, this is, you know, the way that Hancock is actually clinging to Rayleigh, though, it's pretty big for her character. Mm. Wow. Mm. 
No, oh, okay, we're actually, we're going back. Okay. Now that I'm thinking about it, why didn't Kobe order the Seraphims to attack a Blackbeard? Oh, here we go. He's bringing that up. I don't think we know yet what that exactly happened. We hadn't gotten a flashback or anything. Just, yeah, what Blackbeard is saying right now. He just said a woman. No need to translate it like that. Mm. I see. Honestly, <laughs> Blackbeard is pretty smart. Yeah, because if she dies here, then all the people turned to stone won't be brought back. At least that's what Hancock told us, but we don't know for sure. Not too late. At least she's still alive. Oh, oh shit! Damn. Okay. <laughs> mm, now that, yeah. He's there for a guarantee that Hancock won't turn the uh, Blackbeard and Kobe to stone, then. Now he let her go.
What's with the shoujo ass filter? <laughs> Kobe, no! I'm still... Like, why did Blackbeard kidnap him, exactly? Like, what was the benefit on that, of that? I'm still not sure. Or either that or I'm misremembering something. Right, 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 right. Thank you, Karasu. Ah, <laughs> oh, is this movement with Kuma? Oh, Kuma! Oh, man. Mm, I won't forgive him. I expected Dragon to say that with like more gravity, but that's fine. Oh shit! I forgot, yeah, someone contacted the Revolutionary Army here. Though I don't think in the manga it was... Do we see who it was? I think he just has like one line. Oh. Okay. Ah. Okay. No, I thought it was. <laughs> of course, yeah. Luffy doesn't believe it. Good, because he didn't. And Robin knows him well too. Mm. 
Oh. <laughs> Freaking Karibu. Chopper. Oh, they reanimated this? What about K Riku? Of course, not me. Worried, worried about that first. Oh, Brooke, Frankie, and Jimbei didn't leave <laughs> with the straw hats then. Yes, well, only half of the crew did, but yes. Nami didn't. Mm, Tor is gonna come here with the reality check. But okay, this was unfair of him to bring up. I'm, I'll say later, after the episode, why I, why I don't agree with what Sora is saying right here. <laughs> Onigashima! <laughs> I forgot about that. Boo, boo, boo. <laughs> I love how he... <laughs> Sanji, he, he, he feels like he, Sanji is the only one he can insult back. Yes. But I feel that happens every time you spend time in an island. Mm. I mean, there's nothing we can do at the moment. Cross Guild. Daddy, I need Brooke. Mm. Huh, I forgot about that. I don't know which ones would those be. Robin, share with us. Luffy doesn't have to know, but I want to know. Oh, here we go. Oh, screen ratio making it look cinematic. Mm. 
No. No way! A new version of We Are? Oh my god! This is so different than any others we've heard before. Oh, this is so special. It's already making me cheer up! <laughs> Oh man, the variety of everyone's reactions. <clears throat> oh, Shanks? Nose. Huh. No, all of them did. It might not have been tears of laughter only. Oh, this. Oh, and that's the end. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, man. I, <laughs> man, I already really liked it in manga form, but this, this elevated it so much. Oh, man. And for the people who are skeptical that Nagamine wasn't going to be able to pull it off, here it is, he did. <clears throat> the Hancock stuff still, it was all right, but once we got um, back to the Thousand Sunny. Oh, 10 out of 10, bro. Pick. Pick. Ekiru, mienai saki o terashita yuku. Jiwon no ashi the triayai. Sekai no hate wo tomo ni mi yo o. Isho nara ikeru vayaya. I'll abstain and not uh, watch the preview, but I doubt we're going to have anything from January. <clears throat> I-I don't know if, um, we're actually just not going to get any episodes or if we'll get like a recap or like one filler episode, I don't know, uh, but we'll see, you know. Once next week and the week after that come come in. <clears throat> okay, now looking back, <laughs> I know I said uh, once we got back to the Thousand Sunny, but like the stuff with the Revolutionary Army was also pretty good. <clears throat> okay, so 
yeah, I'm gonna say that <clears throat> in regards to what Soro was saying with, you know, uh, when he told Luffy, you know, do you remember what you said when you, you, we uh, asked you about Ace and if you wanted to go help him? And you said this. And it was basically, oh, Ace has his own adventures, blah, blah. For one, uh, <laughs> that's not a good uh, example to bring up to your case. Because by Luffy's doing that, um, it just... Uh, <clears throat> uh, the, the days just kept going and going, and with that, it made it more harder, hard for Luffy to actually go and save Ace. And then, you know, uh, there, that, that might be still a big thing that Luffy holds against himself as to why as to why he couldn't save Ace. Like, that. like I love, love Sora, but I feel that that, that was a, an unnecessary low blow. And just, it doesn't really uh, apply here. Like, Ace was, was someone in another pirate ship who wanted to make someone else a pirate king and he himself told Luffy like you know <clears throat> just go do your own thing and I'll do my own thing and you know if you're in trouble I'll know that you have people uh, that care about you and are capable enough to help you <clears throat> but you know when uh, Luffy saw him Ace he saw that he was alone, he was traveling alone, and he was going after uh, <clears throat> someone who they'd heard only. <clears throat> but by then, Luffy only knew that uh, Blackbeard was the one uh, guilty for <clears throat> no doctors being in uh, Drum Island. Well, he's the one that. Uh, if I remember correctly, uh, he went and destroyed the place, and that's what made a uh, Wapple leave the island. So in that case, you could say he kind of <laughs> did a did a good thing by mistake, but that's either here nor there. Is that he was a capable pirate or strong pirate? But of course, Luffy, without meaning him, couldn't make that kind of judgment. So he's like, oh, okay, sure, go ahead and, you know, do, do your thing. <clears throat> and then, you know... But basically, what I'm trying to say is that <laughs> Ace's situation is not the same. He was le legit, like, being lined up to be executed. Like, that's just straight up not... Uh, something where it's like, oh yeah, he's just having his own adventure. And for Vivi, it's like, yeah, she's the princess of Alabasta and she decided to stay there. But at the end of the day, you guys also let her know that you are her friends, her Nakama. And, you know, she was welcome in the ship anytime that she wanted, basically. So, if she needed help, they would they would go and help her out. And also, you know, yes, she, she, she was, you know, she could defend herself. Although, you know, uh, I would say that if she were to join back, she would be, uh, like, might be the weakest member. But that's, you know, it's because Sora says, oh, she's a tough woman. But like, okay, but against someone like, CP0 or, you know, a very, like, a Yonko. She's not going to, that's not going to matter. She's not in that level, basically. And even Ace, who was stronger than her, uh, still managed to get captured and beaten. So and that doesn't work here. The only thing I'm giving Toro is that 
Uh, we don't know where she is, so we're just gonna go around in circles trying to get to her, not really making any progress for our adventure and just for helping her out as well. So let's just wait and see if more news come, come out to actually go and make some... <clears throat> actually go to her age instead which is uh, something that uh, fair enough but everything else I'm just like Zoro what are you on about <laughs> that just yeah trying to make a comparison between the between those two is just not it's not a th <laughs> something that works so I'm glad that uh, like for others, <laughs> boot him because he deserved it. <clears throat> and as for uh, Luffy saying his uh, goal after the dream, or his dream after the goal, you know, what he actually wants to do after becoming Pirate King. That was done beautifully. I don't really have much to say. I think what I already said, I already said it uh, during the manga reaction. But yeah, I mean, just looking at what everyone had to say is very hard to figure out exactly uh, what Luffy it is, what, what it is that he wants. The most popular theory is that, you know, a ban sharing a banquet, banquet with everyone in the world. But other than that, we don't get any more hints, so... <clears throat> We're just gonna have to wait. I, I'm still not sure what why Oda would keep it like a secret. Why wouldn't he just informs us along with the rest of the Straw Hats? That feels a little weird. <clears throat> but I don't know. Maybe he's saving it for the perfect timing. Uh, but we'll see. I, it's definitely gonna be very satisfying when we finally find out. <clears throat> but yeah. For the longest time, I, I had forgotten that we actually had uh, Luffy basically, you know, technically say that he had something he wanted to say or he wanted to do besides be Pirate King uh, during the flashback with Ace and Savo. But, you know, uh, I think that's... <laughs> That's fair, because after that, it wasn't brought up until one, though, so... Yeah. I think Shanks didn't cry out of laughter. I think he cried because it was probably something that, uh, that Roger also wanted to do. And he was, like, overcome with emotion about basically, like, Luffy carrying the spirit or the will of his... Uh, captain and basically dad. <laughs> yeah, with that all said, uh, pretty good episode all around. Not everything was a 10 out of 10, like I said, uh, but other than that, <clears throat> I'm so very happy with what we got. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, yeah. No, something I forgot about the Jump Festa news. We are getting a new opening and ending uh, at the beginning of January, basically by the next episode, uh, when we get uh, the beginning of Egghead. And it's gonna be Hiroshi Kitadani who did We Are, uh, We Go, I think We Can, but I'm not sure on that one, and Over the Top. And for the ending, it's going to be, I think it's um, Matsuki? O Oki Matsuki? Something along those lines. But it's the person that did the first ending of One Piece. Uh, uh, Maki Otsuki, yeah. Uh, who did Memories. Uh, and so, yeah. That's probably my favorite ending. It's just the most memorable use of it for me. It's at the end of uh, episode 808. With uh, Luffy vs Sanji. So, yeah. I, I just know it's going to be something very memorable again. So, with that said, uh, thank you for joining me of the, with the reaction for this week's episode. And yeah, if you liked it, please like and subscribe. Until next time, see ya.